My name is Jonathan Romero. I'm a student here at DeVry University earning my bachelor's degree in biomedical engineering technology in the College of Engineering and Information Sciences. In the biomedical engineering technology program, the students really learn all they need to about electronics. They learn enough about anatomy and all the medical terminology. So um, basically I'll be working with medical equipment, redesigning and re-engineering the software and the hardware that goes inside of it. What sets DeVry University apart is the fact that we're given these, uh, you know, you get the basic lab skill set and uh, we marriage it with the course. They teach us the insights, like how to do the math, how to break it down, how to redraw everything, the schematics. It was hard work, there's no doubt about it, that I had to work hard to get through it, but um, in the end I think everything paid off and it worked out well for me. It's not uncommon for a student to, at some point, need some extra help. and. I think the faculty at DeVry and the class sizes are such that uh, they can get a lot of help through the faculty. But we also have an academic support center which is staffed by upper class students that have taken this, the courses. One of the things I'm big on is uh, learning computer tools because computer tools is where it's at today. They teach us everything, how to re take it apart and put it back together. Uh, some of these classes were almost directly what I do on a daily basis. We have a student uh, working up at, at GE Medical. As a matter of fact, I took you know, the class up there last February. Uh, we toured the training center. Companies rely or know who DeVry University actually is. So like my brother, and he went here and he graduated, he got a job immediately. No questions asked. Before he even graduated, he already had the job lined up for him. They found him. The jobs in those fields, though, maintaining that equipment are very lucrative. I, I thought this was a great career move for me. I actually see myself going to hospitals during surgeries if like you know someone's gonna cardiac arrest and they need the defibrillator to work and it's not working. I wanna be that guy that goes in there, tweaks it up, does a couple of things, and gets you know, gets involved and saves a couple of people's lives. Why not? I could be a hero.